Concerns from parents over a social media rumor involving a possible hate attack on children prompted Crowley ISD near Fort Worth to take action. A post warning a hate group may try to hurt kids on inauguration day led to an increased police presence at schools. Fox 4's Macy Jenkins spoke to a parent and has reaction from the school district too tonight. Macy. Well, Heather and Steve, I talked to several parents on the phone and on social media today. They say that seeing this post, that's enough to keep the kids home on Inauguration Day. It's heartbreaking in a way that you just cannot describe. Tara Sheehan debating on keeping her two daughters home for the next week after hearing about an alleged threat targeting children of color in Crowley on Inauguration Day. Someone posted an unverified warning on Facebook, which quickly spread, prompting the school district to act. We're hoping that it's not real, but nobody thought what happened last week could ever be real either. A Crowley ISD spokesperson told Fox 4, while it doesn't believe the threat is credible, it's taking steps to protect students out of an abundance of caution. In a statement, the district says, quote, due to recent events of civil unrest in our nation, the upcoming presidential inauguration and concerns spreading on social media, you will see an increased police presence in and around our schools in the days ahead. Knowing CISD the way I do, I want to have faith that they can protect my kids. I think as long as my kids are in the building at their schools, they will be fine. I know those teachers would literally lay down their lives for our kids. Both Crowley and Fort Worth Police Department say they are supporting Crowley ISD and its police department. A Fort Worth PD spokesperson told Fox 4 its intel unit is aware of the post and is keeping a watch on any active threats. As the nation still processes the deadly mob attack on the Capitol last week, Sheehan says she and her fellow parents are hoping President-elect Joe Biden's inauguration next Wednesday is uneventful, both in the nation's capital and in North Texas. We are talking to our kids, telling them that they are not to let anyone scare them into being silent. If anyone has any credible information, they are to speak up because it is just better to be safe than sorry. The district declined to speak on camera today, but says that the increased security in its schools will go on indefinitely.